Okay guys, um, <clears throat> I've been making uh, some real live money trading videos, but unfortunately I, f I keep forgetting to put this mic on. Usually the mic will be saved, but uh, sometimes it's not, and I don't know why, so I would have to have kind of a checklist to set it up. We will probably trade real money once again today. We are watching the euro today. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, we are watching five contracts, which is gold, GC, oil, CL, the ES, which is you know the S and P, TF, which is the Russell 2000 E mini, and uh, the last one is the euro, which is six E. And that's what you see on my screen right now. Um, looks like we have a kind of a seller in control of this market right now. I would like to possibly sell break of lows. Okay, guys, I'm trying to sell one contract of gold at 1102.3. Uh, the reason is you could see this balance area here. The point of control of it is around this area. Oh, we're on the offer right now. And the point of control is actually at 06, so that's what we're going to get. We're going to try to get hit at. Uh, I don't want to get hit at that price. Maybe too aggressive. So, well, you, you know, I might actually try and get filled here. Okay guys, we were filled at 11.02.3, um, I would like to see this level right over here hold. We have uh, this high volume up here as our lean, our target is this low volume down here. It seems as though this gold market, every time it tries to uh, push higher, we will see a very quick drop down. So I'd like to see some uh, continuation to the downside. I'd like to see this level here hold. Okay guys, and we just saw a little run up. So we got stopped out for a $130 loss. Um, let's check out the euro. Okay guys, this is oil here and uh, I'd like to possibly sell it against this high volume right here um, we're gonna have to wait for it to make a little balance area around here chop around around here before I get into any trade uh, you can see we got a lot of volume and volatility it just opened uh, we're near yesterday's high if you look back, we have uh, no resistance, so this market is really just has to uh, chop around here before a trade can be made. And I think oil is what pushed gold up too. Okay, guys, we're short oil from 83. Uh, we are starting to move down. I would like to take it back to this bounce area at the 60s, and it looks like we are moving. In our direction, uh, would like to. Here we go. Go. Come on. We are going to move our stop to break even. And let this one ride. Okay, the trade stopped us out for break even. Uh. Unfortunate. I thought we'd have another breakdown, but guess not. So we're gonna see if another trade comes up. Okay, guys, we got a little bounce area forming <coughs> in gold here. Um, from 96 to 88 around, I would say. And um, I would like to see if this is gonna be a continuation where we go and balance and break out or we are in balance we break out of it then we pull back to the other side which is a failed breakout or failed auction 
or is this a reversal where we just fall out from it? Um, looks like it might be one of those fall outs of it like I was expecting in here. But I want to, if I, th it's going to be one of those, I want to be getting short in the upper range of that. And there it goes. See what happens. Okay, guys, I'm short oil from 85. Reason is if this thing is going to break, like the US markets are currently, and gold and everything, it's going to have to break now. It should not go higher before it breaks. All the other and all the other um, products are starting to fall to new lows, so oil should fall soon. And we are starting to fall pretty hard. I would like uh, to see these uh, this bounce area break here. We now do have uh, a lean because this bounce area broke and that bounce area broke. So the next one to break is the one we're testing currently. Okay, guys, and we took it for $170. Nice trade, and we're up $30, and we're stopping for a $20 profit, minus commissions. Thank you for watching this 